Hi, I'm Gary Fales, President of City Theatrical, and today I'll be training you in City Theatrical's projector dowser. The projector dowser is a DMX512 controlled mechanical dowser for use with digital projectors. When using a projector, simply transitioning to a projected image of black is not enough to ensure total blackout. The projector still emits light, and this can interfere with other light levels and blackouts. The City Theatrical projector dowser changes video black to a real blackout by remotely positioning a large flag over the lens of the projector. First I'll show you the basic setup, then I'll show you various ways that the projector dowser can be hung or positioned around your projector. If you're using a City Theatrical 2199 DMX power supply, it will power up to two projector dowsers. It has a 5-pin male connector to accept DMX from your DMX source, and a 4-pin female connector to send power and DMX to the dowser. The dowser also has a 4-pin female outlet to allow you to chain out to other dowsers. The projector dowser plugs into a 24-volt DC power supply with a 4-pin cable and is compatible with power supplies for Wybron 4Runner, ChromaQ, Rainbow, SpectraQ, Roscoe, and other power supplies. The projector dowser is not compatible with Wybron color ramp power supplies. I'll set the DMX selector switches on the dowser to channel 1 for this training, and I'll supply DMX for my lighting console. Depending on the positioning of the dowser and the projector, the 0 DMX level may be dowser closed, or the 100 DMX level may be dowser closed. In this position, DMX level 0 will be dowser closed, and DMX level 100 will be dowser open. Now I'll take the shaft to DMX 0, and I'll attach the flag. Here's how to attach the flag to the body of the projector dowser. Put the dowser flag on the shaft and adjust its position along the shaft until it is located as close to the projector lens as required. Tighten the two hex head screws in the dowser hub until the dowser flag is locked in position. Be careful and don't rotate the motor shaft or you'll have to rehome. That's it. Now when you move the fader for channel 1, the flag will move away from the lens, like this. The total flag travel is 90 degrees. The dowser flag is made of thin aluminum so it can be readily trimmed with snips or heavy shears. You can modify your flag to meet your special requirements or adapt it with City Theatrical black tack if needed. Replacement flags are available through City Theatrical. The number 4160 projector dowser is provided with an LED for status indication. You can download our projector dowser manual for a full description of the LED status indicators and for full installation and operating instructions. Now that you know the basic setup of the projector dowser, I'll show you various ways to mount it in relation to your projector. We've seen side-by-side -side mounting. The accessory base has holes that allow you to screw into a wood or metal surface. The mounting kit that comes with the projector dowser also includes Velcro to enable you to Velcro the, the dowser to a surface or to the projector itself. You can utilize a cargo strap to mount the dowser to the projector or another object. and you can mount the dowser on a sidearm to give complete control of adjustment independent of the projector itself. I'll show you how. Using a sidearm and sliding T, position the dowser over, under, or on either side of your projector. I'll show it here mounted on the side of the projector. Mount the dowser, home it, and adjust the flag as we did before. The projector dowser user's manual also shows this clearly if you need a refresher course when you're hanging your show. The 4160 projector dowser is also provided with a dry closure control input, which will allow basic operation or manual checkout without using DMX. When the dry closure terminals are open and no DMX control is present, the unit will remain in the home position. When the dry closure terminals are connected to each other, and you can use a paper clip or a short length of wire, the unit will move to the full position. 90 degrees counterclockwise from home position. When access to a DMX controller is not convenient, the dry closure input can be used to check the flag calibration or to troubleshoot the system, much the way a bump button is used on a dimmer. You could even operate your show by connecting a remote switch to the dry closure terminals. Inexpensive projectors play a part in many shows. Our projector dowser is an easy way to eliminate video black via DMX control from your lighting console. Thank you.